Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today is January 28th of 2021. I got paid $688.46. Extra income this week. I resold one of my cars and I got 2064 I'm not going to touch that money. I'm just going to leave it in one of my savings accounts. And then more income from Poshmark. I got $14.40. I resold one of my cosplay sweaters. For bills, I only have two bills this week. One is for collections, $150. And then the second one is for my EDC ticket. That is $59. I'm going to be stuffing $489 and this video is going to be one of my good ones so just stick around and I'll tell you guys what the good news is. So for gas, I'm going to stuff $60. I ate all the gas money. I had a very busy week so there is no gas money so I need to put some so 240 60 60 bucks for gas for spending it's not getting anything groceries is gonna get 20 bucks For car maintenance, it's going to get 30 This is my car maintenance envelope, and it's going to get $30. And of course, my envelope is empty. If you follow me for a while, you know that I had to take care of something for one of the cars. Self-needs is not getting stuff. Credit number two is going to get the $50. It's going to get a 50 but I will count this at the end. So this is my credit number two. And then I took this $1 from, I think, one of my wallet envelopes. So that's going to go towards that. And then these 40 I took it from the rent envelope. Because we bought in and out and long story short, we thought we had coupons, but they expired. So I used my credit card for that, but I'm putting it back. I am removing this envelope completely and you guys will see why. Okay, so that was my wallet envelopes. Now we could move on to my sinking funds. So for rent, it's getting $50. Can you guys see? Okay. It's getting $50. I gave my mom her money because she had to take the kids to the doctors. For school, I'm putting 30 bucks. So, whoops. Okay, so school should have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140, 150, 150 in school. Car and apartment is not getting stuffed. My debt envelope, which I'm going to take out now. My debt envelope is getting $50. Oh no, sorry getting 20 and I'm gonna put it to the side because we'll do this at the end of the video my retirement is getting $20 so retirement now has 100 120 130 135 medical is getting 20 yeah Guys, I messed up big time. I took the $100 out of here thinking I was going to have to pay something for my dentist appointment. And I didn't need to pay anything. But I left the money in my wallet and I just 
literally used it for food oh my god i am so mad at myself so event is gonna get twenty dollars So now event has a hundred. One, two, three, four. Okay. So 120, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86. 186. My savings challenge. So for my savings challenge, I am putting $90. So five. Six, seven, eight, nine. So ninety dollars towards my savings. And now my savings challenge envelope has five ten. So for my giving challenge, I mean Wait, did I do that? Okay, yeah, I did that. So for my giving savings challenge, we're gonna put nine dollars. So five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And now this one has $45. Okay. And then moving on to annual bills. It's not getting stuff. The gifts is getting a 10. And gifts has has 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. I'm going to put this envelope to the side. Graduation is getting $10. So now this envelope has 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. My birthday envelope is getting a 20. So for birthday is 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47. My wants envelope is not getting stuff, but I'm gonna put it to the side. My family envelope is getting a ten dollars so now it has 15. my business envelope is not getting stuff but i'm gonna put it to the side also then my travel envelope is getting the last 20. Oh, okay. so now this envelope has 20 40 50 60 70 80 85, 86, 87, 88, 89. And now I could get to the part where I wanted to share. I might get this money too. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay, now for the exciting part. I am super excited. So this, this credit card has $1,165 with 35 cents. So I took the credit card number two money and all these four envelopes and I'm going to put all this money towards one. So 15 family, the business one had 30, putting it in there. The wants envelope, 35. The gifts has... 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, plus what's in here, oh, I left it open, plus what's in here, so I'm going to count 
this real quick and all of this is going to go towards this credit card i made the decision so i did have just to say it i did have this envelope just for my collections that's like nine thousand something but it didn't make sense at the end for me to just keep saving money on the side for it if it's uh, the highest number so this is the second highest but i do want to close this account and everything with this account so it makes sense for me to just pay this one off faster than any other one so i am going to count all this real quick and see how much we have do i have <laughs> so i can make a payment and then by next month i should be done paying it and officially close down the account so let me just do this okay, part to sort the money out so when i did it i calculated this much 715 but i think it should be more so we have 100 200 I'll put it on this side 200 okay so there's 200 then i'll do it like this one, two, three, four, five, three hundred. You guys can't see, but I have it laid out on the other side. One, two, three, four, five, four hundred. One, two, three, four, five, five hundred. So five, four, that's a hundred. That is six hundred. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, seven hundred. Seven hundred and 10, 15, 20, 25, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So 730 is going to go to the credit card. So that should leave me with, let me get my calculator. calculator so 1165 with 35 cents which i shouldn't even count the 35 cents 1165 minus the 730 equals 435 so that's going to leave me with 435 dollars to pay off and i believe i could do that in like next month so that should leave me with four thirty-five, of course, the thirty-five cents. Oh my god, I am so happy. I could pay off the credit card that has the lowest amount, but I'm trying to keep that account open. So I'm not in a hurry really to pay it off. And I don't really get interest in it either. This Bank of America one is the one that gives me the highest interest. So that is what I decided to do. And yeah, that is actually the end of my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment down below if you guys have any suggestions on what to do different or if you guys like my videos. Yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.